<coughs> hey guys, this is the emergency update. I believe we are going to see witness and uh, maybe they can crash call around to today is November 1, 2020. Uh, gold closed last Friday around 1878 and the pattern I have seen is the pattern of weakness three consecutive months um, gold last Friday went back to the, this area if you see you see that it really went back to the support levels over and over again so we are seeing locals coming back to Europe, the UK, and gold is being sold as a risk asset. So you see this test, and now this test came. Uh, I strongly believe this was a long way selling, a long time selling around this level, which is extremely high, um, and it was followed by the news that central banks were selling gold for the first time in 10 years. So I believe this is a major, major area where they're going to sell gold and they're going to take it down most likely this week. So this is emergency update. Stay with Bitcoin is extremely strong. Maybe it, it was because the Iran adoption of the Bitcoin as a currency, as a medium exchange. Who knows? But it's extremely strong. And we are seeing weakness also in multiple currencies. <coughs> especially the British pound that is announcing new lockdowns coming this week by Boris Johnson. I strongly believe that we're going to see gold hammer this week. So I am uh, the pattern is there. It's a very clear pattern that they're going to hammer gold because it was too much time going down and this is the pattern I have seen for years, but they keep selling the very high levels and ready to crash. So it's very likely that the time for crashing between now and and Wednesday. So stay alert because we are seeing also weaknesses in euro dollar pair. Um, we believe that this is going to be risk off since there is the U.S. elections coming. And they are going to use the window of opportunity to hammer gold immediately. We believe it's going to happen between today and next Wednesday. This week is a week of weakness for gold, so stay alert. That's all.